And today, we are launching Hallmark Channel's Adoption Ever After Fund. Yes! Doing even more. Now, this fund is giving everyone the opportunity to, to, to join us in finding forever homes for all of the shelter pets by donating to some of our favorite nonprofits. It's incredible, Larissa. Mm -hmm. This is amazing. <laughs> if I could be jumping on the couch in excitement, it is so, so wonderful. And, yeah. you know, this month, we are partnering with... Ready? Pet yeah. Finder. That's and wonderful. Pet Finder is, if you've ever written me, if you're a viewer and you've written me with questions about going about finding a rescue animal that's perfect for you, you know that the first thing I ever say is go to Pet Finder. Yep. They're an amazing website. They they aggregate basically all the rescue animals around the country. And so you can, no matter where you live, put in what you're looking for, what age range, what breed, and find a rescue animal near you. I've had to cut myself off from the website <laughs> because I have four right now and I'm not allowed to bring you it just anymore. keep sending people to it that's <laughs> right. all that's yes. your job yes i always find myself when i'm bored going to it but again i'm trying not to but it's a fantastic website and so uh, all the people behind it do so much good work so right. anything that you can donate will help their efforts in saving animals across the country Beautiful. so please go to hallmarkchannel.com slash donate and remember i mean even if you can donate three dollars your morning cup of coffee one day that a month right that, that it all adds up so you know anything Thing you can do to help and will be used in a good good way so thank you i'm so excited we're doing this that's right but wait you also receive another exciting announcement today <laughs> there's more this one's also a big one larissa i know you're very yeah. excited about this we are so glad that we get to share adorable adoptable dogs and cats yeah. with all of you at home it's amazing each and every day but i'm not gonna lie it gets a little bit crowded in here <laughs> it gets a little bit crowded, <laughs> a little bit crowded. <laughs> no doubt about it so that means we are remodeling and we're building a brand new addition to our our house. It's our adoption ever after bungalow. Look at that. Those are the plans so right cool. there. Very excited to debut uh, this wonderful rescue animal space a little bit later in the year. You're going to have to wait to see the final. Is that Larissa in there? That's me. Is that Larissa? <laughs> yeah, that's oh my gosh. They've like you grabbed and dropped you in there. You were sitting on the couch in the in the first one. So oh, just letting you know. room for us, not just Beautiful. I, mi I can't believe I missed myself, but I caught <laughs> Larissa on there. There is space for all of us and it's going to be so great because we have so many animals that come here and, and you know, older, younger, puppies, everything in between. This is going to be a really safe place for them. And, you know, it just it just speaks to, to how how dedicated we are right. to saving animals across the country. I can't wait. I'm so excited. Well, I know. It's very exciting. It's, it really is. It really is. Okay. And now let's meet another one that needs our help because we're all in the helping mood right now. We are going to meet actually two. We have Opal and Gump. And they are a mother-son duo that are bonded. That means they have to go to a home together because they have lived together their whole lives. They are 11 years old and 9, and they lived outside for 10 years without much uh, much love. So let's meet them now, joined by Jen, who is with Always and Forever Midwest Animal Sanctuary, located in Kansas. Thank you so much, Jen. Clearly, I can tell they're a lot of work. <laughs> <laughs> um, they're very, they're, they're that, <laughs> but yeah, this is Gump and, and this is Opal. We call her mama and they are just honestly two of the most amazing dogs we have in the barn. And they've been with us, gosh, almost 15 months now. Um, and we, we certainly appreciate your help in helping them find a home. Oh, absolutely. Tell us a little bit about their personality and who they would be best for in a home. Sure. Well, Gump, I, you can't really tell right now because he's laying down. He's a tripod, uh, but don't let that dissuade you. Um, he will run around with the best of them. They are great couch potatoes. They love to snuggle. They love to go on walks. Um, car rides are the best thing in the entire world to them. Um, I can tell you that they are great with all dogs, big and small. Um, they both adore kiddos. Um, little ones, they might knock over a little bit, but uh, just because Gump's a little chubby, but <laughs> overall, um, just really great, loving, super loyal dogs. Oh, I love them. I really, really hope somebody out there that's watching is going to fall in love with them because we always say seniors, in, in my opinion, are the best dogs. They love doing just what, what we see them doing here and just being lazy and getting lots of love. So thank you, Jen, for 
really stepping up and taking in these seniors that need help. And uh, your, your barn and your sanctuary is fantastic. And I really hope somebody goes to your website. It's alwaysandforever.love, L-O-V-E, which I love as well. So thank you again. Please, somebody go out, fill, go and fill out an application for Opal and Gump. And if you're not near Kansas, that's okay because there are so many wonderful animals no matter where you live, in a shelter, rescue, humane society, you name it, you can find it. So please go and find your adoption ever after today. That's right, Larissa. Thank you so much. And Opal and Gump certainly deserve their forever home, and I hope they find one very soon.